Liberdad will kill you fucking through your eyes. Traidors! Criminales! Puta. Mio, the difference between a true yarn and a fake yarn it can be hard to see, but it's there. A true yarn understands that loyalty to country is key to his survival. Not justice, not love, not even family. Loyalty to a vision that looks beyond themselves. Come mierda. Fake yarns love to be the outcasts. They are addicted to their selfish perversions. Chaos. Lies. Like wild dogs. But dogs can be broken. They can serve paradise. And if a dog refuses to break, like Julio here, like Clara Garcia, like Libertad, then we must put them down. Papa, you've proved your point. Put Julio down. This is a difficult step to paradise, Mio, I understand. But when you achieve our vision, I promise you, there will be no more steps. I'm coming, Lita. Then, enjoy the show. Julio checked in. Proof of death. Join your friend Lita in a suite hereafter. I keep my promises, Danny. You wanted a boat, you got a boat. It's a beautiful piece of shit, but it'll get you to a Yankee beach. One with the naked fatties. You two are just gonna let me leave? Bullshit. You could have sold us out a long time ago. You're my best kid here. I can't promise you victory, I can't even promise you survival. What I can promise you is this. You are the lucky one. That usually work? 50 50. Hell of an office, Juan. Back for more chaos, I see. Back. They always come back.
Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Castillo was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castillo controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Philip Barzaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm gonna get all these groups to sign up for Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Jefa. Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best guerrilla. You are. You're not listening. Translate, Juan. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants, but she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor, from the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See, and you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See, do you want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me.
this into one. You kill soldiers, Castillo's going to send his special forces after you. Know what makes them so special? They're specially trained and heavily armed. Fuck you, smartass. But yes, you've been warned. Clara, I'm on my way to Valle de Oro. Good. I hope you find Maximus Matanzas. How do you know them anyway? Talia and I led the first protests against Castillo. While Paolo mobilized the dissidents, we lost contact after the Esperanza riots. I saw those riots. A lot of people got hurt. This is the fort. Looks like no one's been here for a hundred years. Hey! Uh, Maximus Matanzas! Talia! Talia and Paolo made it out. Someone, maybe they left a note. They wanted others to follow. Clara, Maximas Matanzas was definitely at the fort. There's signs of a gunfight and shit thrown everywhere. That sounds like them. Can you pick up their trail? See, si. They won't be hard to track. That's what I'm worried about. Rápido, Dani. They tried to run with that? <sighs> Idiotas. De nada. Bendición.
That music must be Maximas Matanzas. Cojone, I'm not the first to find them. Inga, hope I'm not too late, officer. <laughs> Rank won't protect you. Clara, I think I found Maximas Matanza's hiding spot. But Castillo's soldiers got here first. Looks like they're having some fun before they call for backup. You know what to do, Danny. Whatever it takes. Eyes up, Danny. Stay awake. You can do it. Sí, está bien. The last of them. You! Get me down from here! Okay, okay! I'm coming! You're gonna cut! 
Cut me down or what, carajo? Ah, ping! You must be Talia. Move. What the fuck? Hey, uh, you think I could keep this? No, yes. Hey, man, you just saved Maximus Matanzas, the most blessed motherfucking group in Yara. Well, I would have done it myself personally, but, you know, I couldn't stop crying. Get out of my way. I'm Bicho, man. I'm from Mexico. Get me the fuck out of here. I know you can hear me. If I let you out, you're gonna behave? Mi amor. Fuck you, Talia. Oh, I thought you wanted to hide like a pussy-ass bitch. You want to die before we get to America? Oh, big man, Paolo. So a real man takes care of his chica by hiding her in a stank-ass swamp. Fucking puta. <gasps> Coño. Oh, that's just foreplay. Okay, okay. You guys ever heard of Libertad? Clara Garcia sent me... Shh. We were Libertad before Libertad. Who do you think dragged Clara to her first protest when she wanted to live in a fucking library? I don't care. Clara knows her boring-ass speeches won't convince Yarns to join Libertad. She needs her voice. Don't worry. Talia's full of shit and so are you. Welcome to Camp Maximus. <laughs> They're animals. Everybody! So those are gone! Come on out! You got this. Paolo's busy again, isn't he? He sent you to help me? Hope you can help. You're still full of shit. A lot more people here than I thought. Are the musicians too? Talia collects dreamers dumb enough to pick fights with Anton's Ministry of Culture. I just make sure they aim the barrel away from the face. Thought I was the only dropout. Papa was a drill instructor. Family's fifth gen army until me. What happened? Expelled. When Papa found out I turned from his favorite daughter into a freak. His words. Shit. Just trans in the military, compai. I was lucky. Talia caught me trying to steal her gear, but instead of turning me in, she gave me a deck. Libertad can help all of you here. Libertad? When Castillo won, we left riots with Clara. And what did it get us? Clara runs off to play guerrilla, Talia gets thrown into Maria Marquesa's bullshit academy, and I have to take a big fucking debt to get her out. From who? Bembe, black market smuggler. Once he's paid off, Talia and I are off this fucking rock. Let me take some debt, Paolo. I don't do handouts. <laughs> okay. Why do you leave the military? Punch my drill instructor in the throat. I'm not a morning person. Segunda. Bembe deals in the church.
¿Qué es eso? ¡Coño! Could be useful. Bad dog. We are depending on you, guerrillas. <coughs> Dog? How did you get in here, boy? Juan, I just found a weapons shipment. American. Interested? Danny, that's like asking Saddam if he wanted more chemical weapons during the Anfal campaign. Of course I'm fucking interested. Found a dog, too. Dogs are useful in war. Long history there. Sergeant Stobby, Chips, Nemo. Does it have a name? No, not yet. What the fuck, Danny? It has no identity? Give it a name. Okay, how about uh, Boom Boom? Perfect. Train him to go straight for the cojones. I like my dogs like I like my wars. Violent, unpredictable, and with a lot of humping. Something tells me Boom Boom's got some fight in him already. Boom boom! Here! Good dog. Who's a good dog, huh? 